so here since f of a is the cyclic expression so here hence the remaining factors are the remaining factors are so a minus b is the first factor then the remaining factors will be of so one is of b minus c then the other will be of c minus a so here has, therefore the factors of f of a are a minus b b minus c and c minus a the degree of this a minus b b minus c c minus a that is a into b into c will be the first term so a to the power of 1 b to the power of 1 c to the power of 1 on the whole so here a to the ab so here degree of this a minus b b minus c c minus a will be of 3 and similarly as per the problem f a so here f of a the given expression cyclic expression is also of the third degree so here f of a is also of third degree because a plus b whole square the first term will be of a square here the first term of the second expression is of a a square into a will be of a cube that it is of third degree so here so here the given cyclic expression that is f of a is a third degree expression and the degree of a minus b b minus c and c minus a that is a b c will be the first term its degree will be of 1 plus 1 plus 1 is equals to 3 so is also of 3 therefore it has only one constant so here hence it has that is f of a has a constant as a factor so here we have to suppose that constant let the constant be let the constant factor be k so here we are supposing the constant factor as k so here then we have so here on the whole then the cyclic expression will be written in this form so here f of a can be written as so constant into a minus b first factor then now second factor is of b minus c third factor will be of c c minus a but here f of a so here f of a is given by means of a plus b whole square into a minus b plus b plus c whole square into b minus c plus c plus a whole square into c minus a is equals to so here right hand side is of k into a minus b into b minus c into c minus a so here in order to find out the k value that is unknown constant one so we have to suppose so here when a equals to 0 and b equals to 1 and c equals to 2 so we are going to suppose so these values of a b and as well as c in order to find out this unknown value that is k the now by replacing these values in this given equation so it will be of so that implies a plus b whole square into a minus b plus b plus c whole square into b minus c plus c plus a whole square into c minus a is equals to k into a minus b into b minus c into c minus a so here in this regard we have supposed a value as 0 b value as 1 c value as 2 by replacing these values in this particular equation we are going to get the value of k then now the next logical step will be of so that implies 
a by means of 0 0 plus 1 whole square into a and b that is 0 and 1 0 minus 1 plus b value is of 1 and c value is of 2 so b plus c so 1 plus 2 whole square into b minus c so your 1 minus 2 1 minus 2 plus c plus a that is 2 plus 0 2 plus 0 whole square into 2 minus 0 so equals to constant k into a minus b so that is 0 minus 1 into b minus c is of 1 minus 2 into c minus a is of 2 minus 0 the next logical step will be of so that implies 0 plus 1 so we can struck off these zeros so your 0 and as well as this 0 0 and as well as this 0 then now 1 square it is of 1 multiplied with minus 1 plus so b plus c 1 plus 2 is of 3 so 3 whole square multiplied with 1 minus 2 is of minus 1 because plus into minus is of minus 2 minus 1 is of 1 2 is greater the sign is of negative therefore it assesses the sign of negative then plus 2 whole square is of 4 then now we are multiplied with positive 2 so here into 2 within brackets then now that is equals to constant multiplied with first of all minus 1 is left over in the first bracket 1 minus 2 here also it is of minus 1 because greater minus least 2 minus 1 is of 1 2 is of negative therefore 1 assess the negative sign then now here 2 is of positive so here into 2 then the next logical step will be of so that implies 1 into minus 1 is of minus 1 then now plus into minus is of minus 3 square is of 9 3 3 is of 9 9 1 is of 9 again then now plus 4 2 za is of 8 then that is equals to minus of minus is of plus so 1 1 za is of 1 1 into 2 is of 2 that is 2 into k is of 2 k on the right hand side then now we are going to simplify first two terms that is the like terms minus 1 and minus 9 the next logical step will be of so that implies minus into minus is of plus we have to add up 1 plus 9 is of 10 9 is greater the sign is of negative then now plus 8 is written as it is then that is equals to 2k so we are going to simplify these two terms so here to simplify further so here the next logical step will be of that implies minus of plus is minus we have to subtract greater minus least 10 minus 8 is of 2 10 is greater the sign is of negative therefore 2 assess the sign of negative that is equals to 2k so here then now in this manner so here by changing the lhs and rhs at a time so here the next logical step will be of that implies 2k right hand side term I am going to write totally on the left hand side and minus 2 which is on the right hand side so here left hand side I want to write on the totally on the right hand side so here at a time we have changed left hand side and right hand side by interchanging the left hand side and right hand sides here that is the reason so here since by interchanging LHS and RHS so here there won't be any sort of changes in their signs so we need only k so the next logical step will be of that implies k is equals to minus 2 overall divided by this 2 because here 2 is multiplied here multiplication when it is transposed over to the right hand side it becomes division so therefore by cancellation 2 ones in the denominator and 2 two ones in the numerator so you will be getting it as that is equals to minus into 1 by 1 is of minus 1 so here therefore i got k is equals to minus 1 we have to replace this k value so in this particular i mean equation so that these are the factors of this given cyclic expression then the next logical step will be of that implies so here at k equals to minus 1 factors of given cyclic expression are of sigma a plus b whole square into a minus b that is of a comma b comma c we have expanded in this form that is a plus b whole square into a minus b plus b plus c whole square into b minus c plus c plus a whole square into c minus a is equals to the factors are of k value is of minus 1 so instead of 1 so i want to write it as only minus then the remaining factors are of one is of a minus b the other is of b minus c the third one is of c minus a so in this manner we have factorized the 
cyclic expression. So, as minus of a minus b and b minus c into c minus a, these are the factors of the given cyclic expression. 